There we go. There we go. Inchworm, push up. All right. Next. Here we go. Good morning. And a squat. Good morning. Get back and down that squat. Good. So feel like your legs are slightly back to the back in the morning. Pushing those hips back, sitting as low as possible. Good. You've got it, guys. Reverse lunge then. Yeah. All right, last set of this. Reverse lunge. You can have a twist if you want. Do a little rotation here. Twist towards that front knee. Ten. Then as you go down, next time on the way up. Good. No one's there. Next. All right. We're resting here, you guys. We're going to get on our hands and knees and do some bird dogs next. Rest of our lower body. Warm up. All right. So let's do five bird dogs per side here. Opposite them, opposite legs. Bring it in for a front. Get back out for five. Four. Three. Two. And one, switch sides here, left arm, right leg, crunch, get back out, press that foot, get that glute, that uh, glute ankle warmed up. Good, stay right here, we're going to do tap, now next, take a deep breath in, for tap, hold it, and then exhale for cow, and hold it for three, two, one, one more push stretch, breathe in, for tap, and cow. Good guys. All right, we're gonna flip it over. We got ten blue bridges. Form up those glutes, and then we are ready to start. Feet are right by our um, glutes. We're gonna push upwards, scaling back down for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, last one here. Good. All right. Let's stand up. I want 10 arms circle forward, 10 arms circle back, and then 10 opening with your chest. Okay, while well, I explain, make sure you guys can see me. Round one. So we are doing everything we've done before, you guys. There's just no new ones. We have a reverse lunge. All right, first we're gonna start with that monster walk, okay? So I want you to really think about keeping those legs nice and straight for this monster walk. You can walk on a diagonal, okay? Or monster walk, no, I'm sticking lateral walks. We're on those toes, we're sticking out our glutes back behind us. We're in kind of that quarter squat. We're just walking on our toes, creeping around. We got 50 seconds of that. Then we're doing reverse lunge, two pulses. So we'll be here. We're gonna do reverse lunge. Two pulses in that squat position, switch. Reverse lunge, two, two uh, pulses in that um, position. So that's a part, that's a time where you can add some weight to your hands. You want to get a little heavier because we're just kind of staying still. And you can wait, uh, add some weight and get a little bit better on the workout if you want to. All right, then we're staying nice and still. We got some abduction. So we're going to do a lateral tap, diagonal from your hip, and then straight back. Okay. And then back again. We're doing that. 30, uh, 25 on one side, 25 on the other. And then our last one is the basic blue bridge. You can add a weight to your belly here. Okay. And we'll do blue bridge, two pulses, one, two, back down. So two pulses at the top and then back down. Okay. I'm all blurry, but you guys get the point. Another one, maybe I'll blur. All right, so have some white candy if you guys want to get a little heavier um, for some of those lunches. All right, Let's see if this will refocus. Hello, there we go. How are you going blurry? I don't know. It just went blurry. But it's fine when I'm close. All right, who knows? You can still see me though. You get yeah. the joke. Okay. All right, let's start with that 30 or no, 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, three rounds. We're gonna start at the B. Here we go. Maybe this will help. Is it focused? Still now. A little bit. Yeah, technology, man. 
<laughs> think it's gonna work. It doesn't work. It's Sorry, fine. I can see you. Yeah, you get the idea. But yeah. All right. Well. All right. We'll start in the beat, you guys. Okay. Starting in five. All right. But it's a uh, monster walk. Very blurry. We're on the toe, okay. walking, in that hinged over position. Keep going, you guys. I'm going to try to fix this. That helps. There we go. All right, come back. Good guys, and that's how done. And so for the monster walk, we're really trying to get the shoulder on the toes, which is like put that behind that, filling in your booty as medial, like medial to the side of your glute. As we're walking. Good, you guys, resting for 10. We got those lunges. So I'm going to start with no weights, and then next round I'm going to pick up a set of weights, and then I have you put a weight in the last move. All right, so it's push one, two, two pulses, then foot away. Two pulses, foot away. Make sure your band is a place where you feel in the mode. Feel the resistance. Okay, feel like you have to pull that band apart. 25. Good. We're halfway there. You can put most of that weight in that front foot or you lunge it. Okay, so you can say about 70-30 for that weight configuration. 70 in the front, 30 in the back. Got that nice hold here. Good. Well, almost there. All right, we're gonna have done it now. So you sit down nice and still. And we're gonna stand full and belly button nice and tight. And we're gonna do that junction. Each side. So here, top, reverse, and then back. Good. Okay, we're gonna do that one more time. So we're gonna do it again. Right now, we're gonna do it in the back. In about five seconds, right here. Keep going, stay nice and strong. This is a good time to work on your core. Let's do the side right here. Tap it over on the other side. Good. Pull that band apart. As you notice your band is getting a little easier, you're getting stronger. A and B might be a new band. As they start to start to process with your system. All right, we got five seconds to go. Three, two, right. time. Good guys, two good bridges, two pulses. All right, so we're on our back. We are hip width apart, down front. Push up for two pulses, back down. Big push for two, back down. That's it. The two pulses, squeezing them through to get the top. Play around with how far apart your heels are from your booty will help you figure out the right position where you're going to get the best, uh, the, well, the best muscle activation here. So I find if I keep my legs a little further out, I use more of my glutes than my quad. Good. We're almost there, guys. Well, seconds to go. Push those glutes up high. Back down to tap. Good. Stretch. Three, two, rest in time. All right, we're back to the top. We got that monster walk. Take it out of weight. If you want, but you're walking on those toes all the way around. Definitely feeling it now. You're on the chest, loop or push back behind you. You're just walking. That's good. Guys. Okay. Right. On the toes, turning, pivoting. As you turn, 
Make sure you're staying low and you're feeling it where you need to. And then salute. Almost there. Five, three, two, time. All right, so we got reverse lunge, two full sets. Good, and grab some weight. We're gonna get going. So left leg back, two full sets, switch leg. Two full sets, switch leg. I want you to really activate this one so I'm keeping my hips hip angle pretty close. So hold by. Driving with those glutes. As we stand up, good. Focus on that breath. In and out. As you fall. Good. Good, guys. Driving that front foot. Breathe in as you go down. Back to the leg up. Keep those weights right by your front knee. Good. All right. Get rid of those This one next one. We got three point out junction. Feet are hip width apart. Make sure they're in a spot. Your band is keeping you consistent. Left leg tap, tap, and tap. Good. Stay nice and strong here. Try not to lean over. Into that other leg as you're pulling that band apart. Good. Breathe in through that belly. Raise your core. Switching in three, two, one. Switch it out. Tap, tap, tap. Good. So here we're working the gluteus medius, which is like the side part of your glutes, as you add up. As you pull apart the band, pull your leg away from the leg that's planted. Good. Five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, on our back, loop bridge, two fold this. Gotta have your weight here. All right, here we go, guys. Two fold this. One, two, back down for a release. Two fold this, release. Breathe in that belly. So break that core. Feel like your core is nice and tight. As you're pushing forward, the legs come down towards the ceiling. We're halfway there. Good, so settle in. Push those foot forward. Now let's move a little faster. This time we're going pretty slow. Get me trapped in. Eight seconds. Let's are on five and three. Two, one. All right. Last round. We got our monster walk starting in five seconds. You can always grab a weight and hold it as we walk. Here we go. On those toes. And we're walking. Good. Keep that hip angle slow as you're on those toes. Walk in. Put those woods up behind you. I like to call this a monster walk, but it's also a T-Rex walk. Put your hands out forward if you can make a T-Rex. Check it out. Halfway down. Okay, 15 seconds. We're almost there. And five. Three, two, one. All right, for first lunge, two full sets. All right, this is the last round of this. Grab those weights. Here we are. First lunge, two full sets. Hold that new table. Two full sets. Good. Stay low. Keep that new table the same. So you want to stand up? I'm still not staying all the way up. Just keep that angle, come close. Good. Good, you guys. Maybe. One is nice and deep. 
to you. It's very, it's a very uncommon thing to happen. Okay, so we're here. We're going to do a dead bell pull on our leg. Dumbbell pull over here to here. Okay, pull over. So a little bit straighter arm or um, a slightly bent arm as you come back at those dumbbells. Okay, this is not a, this is not a tricep extension or a skull crusher. Our arms are going to be slightly bent we're really working from our shoulders here, okay? And you're you're gonna hold that position with the dead bug lower back on the ground. All right. Make sure you start light on that because it can be a little harder at the beginning until you get the curve the hang of it. All right, then we're doing the hammer curls. So hammer curl here. We're actually gonna do them fast, alternating this way. Okay, I don't usually do them this way, but I want to switch it up today. So we're doing hammer curls like this. Every 10 seconds or 15 seconds, we're going to do a five second hold. All right, so I'll count you guys. We got 15 seconds of movement, 15 to 10, five seconds of hold. All the way to the end. 
All right. And then our last one is a single arm raise and then a lateral raise. So we're going to be here. Single arm raise forward and then laterally 45 degree and then we'll switch sides. OK, so we're working single arms today for that one on the shoulder. We'll do a push later on. So we're just getting that pulled up first. All right, guys. That's it. Uh, 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We'll start at the beep. And here we go. Everybody good? Make sure you have those lighter weights for around. You so you don't hear me grunt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can put me on mute or put yourself on mute. All right, guys. We got the pullover and the round. Let's start with this. Starting in five, four, three. Two, one. All right, we're starting with that row and that push up. So here we are one row, one push up, alternate side, row, push up. We're doing this the whole time. So take your time, make these push ups perfect. Inhale and go down, exhale on the way up. Pull that, pull that dumbbell back to the ceiling. Good, guys. We're halfway done. Hold and a push all together in one exercise. Woo. Get a little harder. Make sure you keep those weights up by your shoulders. Don't let them creep down towards your belly button. Now we do your push up. Good. We're almost there, guys. Last one. Good. Stay down here. We're going to do your pull over next. So on your back. Dead bug position. Lower back, push on the ground. Arms are slightly back. Come down, come back up. Okay. Nice and light. I'm going to do my single to make it a little easier for my shoulder because I'm like a big baby. I don't like to pop out. Good, okay, guys. So all the way down. You don't have to touch the ground with it. I want you just to feel. When you're getting to work out here, your muscles are working. And to pull them back, you can pull your arm back up to parallel. Um, and then I'm going to with your shoulder, okay? If that makes any sense. So you don't have to touch the dumbbell to the ground. As long as you feel like you're getting an extension there. Good. Three, two, one. Awesome. All right. We're on our feet. We got hair for curls. All right, we're working alternating sides here. We've got 10, 15 seconds of this right here. So we're alternating this way. Okay, you can fast. Good. In five seconds, we're going to do a hold. Three, two, one. Hold for five, four, three, two, one. Back to rotating. Woo! It's a little harder at that hold. Good, guys. Five more seconds of movement, then we're going to hold. Three, two, one, hold. Good. So the last 10 seconds of movement. Let's work right here, moving. Ooh, can barely move these dumbbells. Three, two, one. Great time. Grab those lighter weights for this, you guys. We got the lateral and forward raise. Here we go. All right, forward, one arm, same arm, goes laterally, okay? Straight up to your shoulder, you don't have to go above. Breathe in, brace that core. Make sure your shoulders are nice and soft here, okay? One to be nice and relaxed. Good. 30 seconds to go, the breath is heavier when you Walking out. Focus on each set, making it perfect. We know this is trying to uh, repeat. There's a lot of shoulders right here in a row, but work on that form. Good. And five seconds. Looking good. Ash speed. Three, two, and five. All right, we're back to the top. That's it. So our four, we got that uh, push up and that row. 
Here we go. Push up. Single and row. Trying to keep those hips down as you row. We're not going to turn them out. We're really going to utilize our back. Left foot to do that row. Almost there, guys. Almost halfway. Breathe in. Exhale. Let's get four more in. Four. Three. Come on. Two. One more. And one more after that. We're moving too fast. This could be the last one. Three. Two at a time. Stand down here on your back for them to pull over. All right. Here we go. We are doing those pull overs. Slightly bent arm as you come over. You can do doubles. Oh, sorry, dead butt too. Dead butt hold. Here we go. Good. Here's that lower back. You're fighting it too much with the dead bug pullovers, which would be unfailing like that. You're still working your arms with our goal here. This is just a little bit extra. You feel like you extra? You must keep it up. All right, eight seconds. Keep those arms slightly bent as you do these pullovers. Three, two, one. Good. All right, we're all about these camera pros next. We're going to do 15 seconds of the movement, 15 seconds of holding on facing each other. Let's work. Good. So we're going to be a little faster for these camera pros today. We're adding that holding. It's going to feel a little different. Three, two, one, and hold. We're holding three, two, one. Now we're moving. Let's go. 15 seconds. We're halfway done. Get a little slower on that movement. We're going to hold in three, two, one. Hold. Five more seconds or ten more seconds of movement right here. Let's go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, and one. We're resting. All right, you guys. We got some raises here. Arm. So forward and 45 degrees. Now breathe in. Stretch up tall. Raise your belly. Make sure we're stretching up through our core. Focus on nice and soft here as we're working. Only bring that parallel to the ground. Good, Ashley. You can just arm very slightly back here. We really want to utilize the shoulder working. Good. The singles make it a little easier to focus on the corner and do it up. Good, five seconds. Three, two, last one here. Good. All right, we're back to the top, guys. Feel like your push ups are always big push up. Push up, row, row. Last set here. Sit. Push up and row on each side, or one row per push up. So row, push up, breathe in, exit on the way up. Pull that weight back. You got it. Perfect push up. When you're tired, go to your knees. So keep the same form. Push in. Exhale. Push up. Take it easier. I know this is the harder round right here. The push ups are killer. You got it. Move the whole time. You get to rest in. Long stretch. Five seconds to go. One more push up, guys. Come on. All right, we're resting. Flip over. Pull over next. Take your time on these pullovers. 
picture for, lower back on the ground, legs up, okay? Pull over, keep the uh, waist right above your shoulders as you're one breath and one working. Good, guys. Palms are facing each other. Breathe in as we go down. In, out, in, out, right. We're almost there. You got eight seconds to go. Big arms, all the way back, all the way up. Three, two, right. Awesome. All right, we're up. Camera throw back. Okay, we're moving fast. Camera girls up, down. Got 15 seconds. Alternating sides. One goes up, and one goes down. Don't move your fast. This one on the rest. Reach arms. All right, we're holding in three, two, one. Hold. Five seconds. All right, back to work. Here we go. Shoulders are down. You got it. Focus on your breath. Breathe in. Exhale. As we're moving, we're holding in three, two, one. Holding. Woo! All right, last 10 seconds of work. Let's go. Up. My biceps are dead here. Let's go. Go on. Dig deep. Last one. Good. We're done. Last exercise, guys. Shake it out. We got the single arm raise in. So, one forward, 145 degrees. Okay, palms can be facing out. So, I have it resting on my side, but I'm not working with my palms out. Good. Here we go. You got it. Shoulders are down. Good. Breathe into that belly. Let's go. Almost there. Halfway. This is our last high exercise. Get a little break before we do our last circuit. 15 seconds. And as you go, up and down. Five, three, two, and time. Awesome, guys. All right, grab some water. We get our last set. Let's work it up right now. All right. So, for our last exercises, we have a Romanian deadlift. Single leg chest slide or single single chest single arm chest slide. Um, so we'll do that. We have a fine line hip press and then an Arnold press. Okay, so we're gonna do the Romanian deadlift first. So that makes just a little bit of a straighter leg. You can add two weights in your hand. Okay, I'll show you. So my knees are gonna be slightly bent. We're gonna start at the top. Okay, feet are hip width apart. I'll start at the top. Look a little bit straighter with the leg and then come back. That's really working on our glutes. Okay, so from here, I need to slightly bend as I reach, not super bent. Okay, for me, that's 30 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. All right, I'm going to do a single arm chest slide. So we're going to be here in that quarter squat. We're going to do a single arm chest slide. Okay, just alternating sides. That's it. Single arm chest slide. You can do single, single, double if you want. Make it a little harder. Okay. Um, arms are slightly bent here. I'll do that chest slide. Then we're going to be on our side for a sideline hip thrust. We haven't done any um, sideline anything today. So front foot is facing up, bottom foot is facing down. We're going to do that sideline hip thrust this way. Okay. So open and close. You can put your band on for this. You can actually put your band on for the whole time. Um, and do intermediate deadlifts with them. It's not going to it's not going to make it much harder, but it'll definitely be a little bit harder. And our last one back is a good old Arnold press. 
Okay, arms here, facing palm facing up, and then they're gonna face you as we turn and rotate for that out. Okay, that's it. Those are your four. 30, 10 is our um, time scheme. We'll do this three rounds. We're gonna roll through it pretty quick. All right, so let's get this going. Okay, get this music pumping. 30, 10, three rounds. All right. All right. Starting with that, we need dead rescue guys. Three. Three, two, one. Take those waves. We're walking it down and then back up. Using your glutes to drive. So once you're at the bottom of this, we're making that let feel like you're using those glutes to pull you up. There you go. 15 seconds. Nice. Pull up with those glutes. Eight seconds. Five. Three. Two. And time. Good, grab a leg of weight here. You got that single arm and squat. So, quarter squat, hands over, arms are bent, open, close. That's it. Good. Good, guys. Just focusing on pulling that um, weight back to parallel with your shoulder. Good. You got it. 10 seconds. Good, looking good. We're almost there. We're going to get on our side next. Three, two, one. We're on our side. So our left leg first, side line hip thrust. Here we go. So we'll push you forward with our glutes. This is the goal. Forward. Pushing like a side line hip thrust is exactly what it is. Good, push forward. Back down. Good. We're going to stay on this side the whole time. Halfway done. Good, guys. Push forward. Back down. Five seconds. Three. And time. Drop down on feet. This is a quick one. We got the Arnold front snap. Here we go. Rotate, press, bring it back. Rotate, press, bring it back. That's it. Stay nice and strong with that ab screen right here. Good. Working hard. 15 seconds to go. 10 seconds. If it's not hard by now, next round grabs and have your weight. We should just feel like this is a challenge. Three, two, one. Awesome, guys. Back to the top. We're making a jump. Let's drop those heavier weights. Good. Back. Here we go. Three, two, three. Stand. Three. And stand. Good. Feel like as you stand, you're really engaging your glutes to pull you up. 12 seconds to go. Breathe in as you go down, as you go on the way up. And flat. Three, two, one. Awesome. All right. Just fly here. Single. There we go. Feet are hip width apart. Quarter squat. Bend arms. Work. Good. Good. So feel like you're just keeping that. Angle on your arms the same, just opening up, rotating your shoulder backwards, 16. and just opening that way. Good, guys. Good. We're all lifting up. Five, three, two, and one. Sideline to front. We're on the other side of the time. So that's right side. For these, uh, let your feet together. Let's work here. Forward, back in. Open, close. Crumble it in. Push it forward. Good, guys. I really want you to feel like there's kind of a bad right now. 
that you're actually pushing forward and getting a certain line for your hips. Good. Five seconds. All right. Last Here we go. Palms being Open. Close. Good. Rotate that hand back up again. Lower back. This will be part of two exercises. Rotate our shoulder. Good. You can do a little parallel to the ground. You can do a full here. Eight seconds. Five. Two. And done. All right. We're in our last round. We make this one a quick one. 20 seconds, or 30 seconds to work right here. So make it nice, let's let it And back to standing. Good. These are slight events. You're going to keep them straight or them normally, though. Good. Good. So try to get a little bit more resting. That goes a little bit faster. Five seconds. We got this. And time. All right, we got this down flat. Here we are. Half quarter clock right here. So we'll just behind you. And we're just gonna open the shoulder. Open up that chest. Single, single, or single, single, double. I like the singles today. Right, double, so fine. Okay, I like doing the single work today. Really isolate that muscle on that side. Good, we're almost there. Eight seconds. Five. Three. Two. And one. All right, last tip for us. We're going to swap this one through. So make your turn to swap through. We don't have a lot of time for either one of these guys. Let's go. 15 seconds on the left. Okay, slow. Open low. Good guys. Push those hips forward. Not necessarily pulling the band apart. We're pushing three, two, one to the side. Right back to work. Push forward. Good. All right, we're off on our feet. Arnold Brown. Have your weight to this part. Let's go. Last round. Up on those shoulders. Open. Press. Bring it back. Good. Nice form, Ashley. Looking good. Breathe in. 15 seconds to go. Good, guys. 10 seconds. You got this. Breathe in. Exhale. Pull it nice and tight. Your core towards your lower back. Awesome. All right, drop the weight, guys. Good. All right. Good work. That was harder for me today. Maybe, I don't know why. Maybe those, uh, maybe that tough mutter really was harder than I thought. <laughs> All right. So, no, no excuse. <laughs> yeah. Well, we were so beat last night, like just so tired. I think from being, I was so cold. I mean, it was hard. It was definitely hard, a challenge. Yeah. All right. We're going to start with trying that kickback. We didn't work for triceps. We worked everything else today. So we're going to start with a minute of trying that kickback. We're going to do 15 seconds of movement by one, a five second hold. Okay. So try to take back. We're going to bend the Bend the knee, bend our elbows. We're doing it this way, okay? You can do singles too, and then we do the hold. We hold for five seconds, both arms. All right, try that. And we got a last minute of progress, then we are done. You spit it out. Okay. Okay. All right. Here we go, guys. All right. 
We're going to start at the beat with those tricep kickbacks. Three, two, one. Here we go. Fun again. All right, keep going. Single, single, all the way. Keep going. We're going to stop at the 45 second mark with the hold. That way. All right. And we're holding three, two, one. Hold, five, four, three, two, one. All right, so take that single. That's a single. Good. Really focus on that tricep. Instead of swinging, really control it. Three, two, one. We are holding for five, four, three, two, one. Good. Back to kicking back. 15 seconds of this. Okay. Yeah, usually she comes. And Veronica has been coming this month to um Buns and Guns. But usually this is like the base, this is like the busy class. Yeah. I know, that was good. Thank you. Everyone's still doing Wednesdays, but um hopefully they'll be back for next month. You have, you have a lot of people come at nine now, right? Yeah, I have a lot at 9 30. Or 9 30. Yeah, yeah. The other class. All right, let me take a picture, you guys. Real quick, let me stop this real quick. All right. Hold on. You want to work out with us? 